Ever wonder what is the best intelligent flight mode for your DJI Spark? Well today I'll be showing you, especially when you're doing short films and cinematic films. Let's get started. So the first intelligent flight mode that I recommend is Tap Fly, as you can see here. If you're a one-man crew, you're a director, actor, and pretty much everything else, this is the best uh, intelligent mode that you want to use. For example, you need to plan ahead of time how you want the uh, film will look, and basically the actor, which is yourself, walk towards it. So this is really good if you know uh, where you want to go and you you compose your shot right up front plan it ahead and there we go it looks really cool as you can see here my next favorite intelligent flight mode is the tripod mode this mode allow you to have full control and the shot is very stable as you can see here I'm controlling my remote and uh, as I walk I just move my remote full throttle and it's moving very slow and smooth you can see here so this is great for example if you have an actor and you want to follow that actor as he or she walks uh, in the scene as you can see here it's quite right fine-tuned there's also a grid there to help you compose your shot so it's very easy to plan how you want the uh, uh, actor or actress to be in your frame as you can see here so tripod mode you control it manually but when you uh, control the joystick you, even with full th throttle it's still very smooth as you can see here my most favorite intelligent flight mode is the active track mode this mode is very useful especially if you want the drone to follow you one method I like to do is that I get as close as possible to myself and then once it is able to track I then set it on a slight angle around 39 degrees clockwise or counterclockwise as you can see here it does a pretty good job if you're walking at a steady pace and you plan how you're gonna walk in the scene then it's gonna do a pretty good job uh, the intelligent uh, flight the active track uh, are quite good I would say uh, there are time for example uh, if you do a uh, you know very um, erratic movement then it may not be able to track it I'll give you an example here as I um, right now it's doing a pretty good job but here around here I think it's when it kind of lost me because I'm out of frame I think that's yeah there we go see I'm out of frame and uh, so what I have to do again I have to tap on it I notice the flight is also low too. The uh, the the the, uh, the drone shouldn't be too low. Um, it should be a bit higher, and then uh, you have to reset it again. But other than that, I think the active track um, does a pretty good job, um, especially if you're doing uh, one man uh, filming, and if you are the main person walking or the main actor, then this is uh, a very useful tool I highly recommend this uh, active track uh, mode it's probably one of my favorite if not it, uh, the most favorite uh, of all intelli intelligent flight mode yeah so yeah those are the top three again just to review the uh, active track mode very good the tap to fly is also amazing and then tripod mode is also amazing as well hopefully you can find uh, these modes useful and I would say I'll probably gonna use it more often thanks for watching educatetube.com